<laughs> and to comfort me as I die of male breast cancer. Did I ever tell that story of um, when I I went? I don't call it breast cancer. I, I went to the chest, cancer. I call it chest cancer. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. Went to the cancer what? I went to the cancer doctor with my parents because mm -hmm. my parents were were going to uh, L.A. to Cedar Sinai to cancer to the doctor. And um, we left and we met up with my aunt and uncle and they were like, let's get sushi. So it was like an intense day. We're like meeting with a cancer doctor for the first time. And uh, we went to this place, uh, what's it called? Uh, Sugarfish? That place in Santa Monica. The cancer place? No, no, the sushi place. Oh, There's one say, by here. A weird name for an oncology place. Yeah, yeah. Sh Hi, I'm Dr. Sugarfish. Yeah. I'm here to solve, cure your brain cancer. Um, so then we went to, yeah, we went to this, this place, Sugarfish, and uh, we sat down at this table, and sitting right next to me was this pornographic actress that I'd beaten off to maybe over a hundred times in my life. Mm -hmm. And I was like sitting there with my family. Well, she was at the sushi restaurant? She was si at the sushi restaurant who, sitting next to me. Who was it? Um, this, this woman, I don't want to say her name. Why not? I mean, it's this woman, uh, Lana Rhodes. Lana Rose? Yeah, Rhodes. Yeah. Lana Rhodes? She, I gotta say, she used to look better before. She got a lot of plastic surgery. Well, maybe she has cancer if she was getting No, a she wasn't thing. at the cancer doctor. I know, but dude. she's right next door at the, the hot lunch spot for the, all the cancer no, patients. No, it wasn't that close to the hospital, but no. yeah. But it was a very intense day. You'll get cancer. You're a really it. sad cancer day that I had with my family. And then we went to the sushi restaurant. And then. Uh, and then I had the sensation of like, oh my God, I've beat off to that lady a million times. I would never in my life recognize this woman at a restaurant. I've recognized her. She has a tattoo on her butt. Yeah, but she wasn't sitting at the table. Like, I could recognize her. Like, ooh, I love, I love the way my ass feels if on I've, the table. If I've beaten off to a girl in porn, it's kind of like we move on with our lives and... Um, She's like an ex-girlfriend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw w another one that I'd beaten off to plenty of times in New York the other day. What? Who? Uh, Jesse something. Or Jesse Snacks. Jesse Snacks. They always have a name like that. Yeah, no, Jesse... She's like not a porn star anymore. I think she makes like clothes or something. She's like an entrepreneur. Yeah, Jesse Clothes. Jesse Clothes, yeah. <laughs> but I saw her. But like, how do you do it? Like, if you, someone's like, I love the pod, you know, to you? Like, what's yeah. the... What, What's the version of that for a, for a pornographic actress? Um, well, you confused you. I, you I, what I would do, not that I would do this. It's like a neg. No, not a negging, but like, oh my God, aren't you on Days of Our Lives? Yeah. And they go, no. And they're like, yeah, but you're an actress, aren't you? And then they say, yes. And you say like, well, I'm a big what fan. Have you been <laughs> yeah. I'm a big fan. I'm a big fan, yeah. All right. You know what? You spare everybody the embarrassment. It happens so quick, she can't put it together. Yeah. You know, maybe she thinks you're a little bit random and confusing. Yeah, a little bit random. Maybe she's like that guy's random. A little mentally disabled. That guy's that guy's like random. I think this guy's mentally disabled. I think this guy might be mentally disabled. I think he might be like mentally disabled. Yeah, I wish I was. I hope I get kicked in the head by a horse or something. Yeah. Soon.